Good morning. Good rocking morning to you. Yeah. Rocking out with the cereal guitar. You like that? No, actually, now that you mention it, I think it's the dumbest and silliest thing that I have ever seen in my entire life. You have hit a new low and it's not funny and you're just being silly now. That's so sad. Losing weight, it's not just a physical thing. It's here and it's here. Fight through it. You can do it. Don't give up. Oh, it's waffle day. Yeah. It's a mm. little it's a little foggy in here. I don't know why. I don't know. Who is that's weird. Maybe we were dreaming. Could have been a dream. Maybe it was all a Cause dream. yeah, it's so weird. It's a little foggy in here. Yeah. Maybe the weather came in. <laughs> Look, we're craving chocolate chip waffle. And I'm gonna eat chocolate peanut oh, butter. Yeah, just to go chocolate oh, peanut butter. Oh yeah, look at these. Oh. Friends, chocolate chip waffles, chocolate chip peanut butter, and nanas. Oh yeah. Oh buddy, oh, you're gonna put it on the whole thing. Yep, you must. Now you're gonna smish it on. Oh. For the friends so they can, so mm, the friend you can drool now. <laughs> I'm drooling on the mm. camera. Oh. oh, I gotta get out all those last little bits. Don't leave any bits in there. No. Nope. Okay. Now. You lick your thumb. Yeah, but also you licked it. Mm-hmm. Mm. Approve. <clears throat> now you're gonna put your banana on. Yep. Oh, hi, banana. We don't eat bananas during the week, so this is like the best treat in the whole land. Yep. And I'll save that for Hank. You have to line them up, you see. I thought you were, might, might make a smiley face, but you really can't. It's too small. It's too small. There you go. Look at that. It's a flower. That looks pretty delicious. Mm-hmm. That's what. I'm a waffle making pro. Friends, this Jif chocolate peanut butter, you guys in the States probably have had it for a long time, but in Canada we just got it and it's really, really good. It's mostly peanut butter with a slight hint of chocolate. Yeah, you can taste the chocolate. It's it's really good, but mostly it's peanut butter. Now, sure but Stir up it, baby. Mm -hmm. mm. And another one. Yep. That looks oh. just beautiful. Oh, yeah, you're a genius. Look at that <laughs> trip action. Did they, friends like that? <laughs> I got excited. I think they liked it. <laughs> they did. And now, I shall have a bite. You gotta slice into it very nicely. Okay. Okay, you gonna take a piece. Get everything on there. Hold on. Let's just see for 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 the friends. If a friend can have a bite. Okay, you're giving them a bite. Sarah. That's nice of you. You like it, friend? Mm. I bet that's gonna be like a step up from last time with the chocolate peanut butter. Mm. Uh oh, she's wiggling again, friends. Mm. Oh yep, yeah. good. <laughs> mm. I like that. Oh yeah, lunch time. So. We're gonna show you how to rock a homemade pizza with garlic naan bread. That looks delicious. Look at this, friend. And it smells so good. The smell is amazing. We have some Unico or Unico pizza sauce. Just the reg regular kind, right? Yeah, authentic. Okay, I'm gonna go first, all right? All right. Is that all right? I do. I I, friends, I'm a saucy friend. I like lots of pizza sauce. Let us know if you're a saucy friend or not saucy or a little bit sauce. I'm a little bit saucy. I'm not a saucy friend. I'm just a little bit saucy. <laughs> hey, I must say, you're looking mighty handsome today. That's a beautiful color shirt you got on. Thank you. 
You're, you're just a handsome one. Ready for saucy time? Yep, let's go. Have we ever made on uh, naan or nan bread before? A long Either? time ago we have. I can't remember. But we haven't on cheat day. We usually use like the pitas. And I don't think we've had garlic. We definitely haven't had garlic naan, only the plain naan. Hey, fr the friends, do you use naan to make your own single personal pizzas? Personal, single, party, <laughs> individual pizzas. And have you used garlic naan? Because it smells really delicious. And if you've never, if you don't like pizza, we don't want none of that. <laughs> you knew that was coming, friends, didn't you? <laughs> some, some sort of joke. Okay, I think that's saucy enough for me. Yeah, you you are a saucy friend. No, I'm gonna do cheese first. I don't know. Oh. If, I don't know the order or the rules. We got some uh, pizza mozzarella cheese. Well, let's ask the friends what the rules are because I don't know. Some people put their toppings first. I always have, and other people put the cheese first. Now, I think pizza places, they put the cheese first, don't they? Uh, I really, I've eaten pizza a million times and I couldn't tell you. Friends, if you know the rules, please let us know. That looks lovely. Now, let's show the friends the pepperoni we got. Okay, so Ziggers. Ziggies. Ziggers. Ziggy. It's Ziggies, but I like to call it Ziggers. Wow, you're like making a masterpiece. Look at this. Yep. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna take inspiration from my husband. Well, I'm really just throwing it together. I think you can't really go wrong with some good bread, some mozzarella, and mm. some pepperoni. That. Yeah, you, we could have, sometimes we do ba bacon or pineapple and stuff. We kind of want it just a simple, like, pizza. Yeah. The old classic, the old pepperoni and cheese. That looks lovely, I, I think do. that's about perfect. And what we're going to do with these friends, we're going to pop them in the toaster oven. Oh, yeah. And make them toasty. And we'll show you when they get all bubbly and cheesy and toasty. Mm. And then we're going to eat. But, but, but we have to eat one of these sausages. Okay, we have to, we have to mm. taste, we have to taste test the sauce. The Not sausage, it's pepperoni, but I want to call it sausage. Mmm! Does it taste like Ziggy? Mm-hmm. But you don't want to eat Ziggy's. They're human. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. Doggy, you make up yours now. And then we'll do pop the, them in the toast. Do the friends know we call each other doggy? I don't think they I do. I think it would make them vomit if they knew that. So I'm going to edit that part out. <laughs> that clip right there is going in the bin. Recycle bin, that clip. But we don't... I don't even... It used to be monkey and then now it's you know, doggy. We kind of call each other like not... Definitely never our real names. No, never Kyle and Nicole. Which is Trevor and Ashley. <laughs> but yeah, never our real names. It's always, always dog. whatever come like comes out as doggy, monkey, usually an animal, which is kind of weird. Yeah, it is weird. I have no idea how we transitioned to that, but we did. Hmm. We're we're the weird couple. Okay. I must say something about us. Yeah, we're weird. We're animals. <laughs> okay, let's toast them up. Let's do it. <laughs> While the pizza's toasting. We're gonna have these. Yeah. Look, oh, wait, his nose is covered. You got a mustache now. Look, I got a mustache. We're gonna have chips and dip. But we got dill pickle and we have these heat wave, which is barbecue and then heat. And we love both of them, so we couldn't decide. So we might mix it up. And we're gonna have this Philadelphia dip dill pickle. We're getting double dilly with it. Oh yeah, dilly, getting have, dilly with friends, it. Friends, have you guys ever dipped dill pickle chips and dill pickle dip? You just, you almost have too much dill. Did we ever ask the friends what their favorite kind of chip is? Maybe, maybe not, let's oh, ask them. The friends, what is your favorite kind of chip? Look, you can see there's real bits of panther in there. <laughs> so you know it's good. And so, and also, are you a, like a smooth chip friend or are you like a ruffle? friend. I love ruffles actually a lot but I do enjoy the smooth ones every once in a while. So I'm gonna put a few bings of dip on my plate. A few bings of dip? Uh oh I smocked it on the floor but it was on the table. You're, you're using a lot of language here that uh, <laughs> just flying right by my head. Bings uh, and smocks. You're used to it by now you married me. I have never heard you talk like this before. In no my life. never. 
Wow, bringing a dip on. Real bitch with cancer. Okay, I'm gonna eat these. smell o vision friends. Oh, the friends, you'll love it. Maybe the friends don't like dill pickle. Maybe they don't get dill pickle. I don't know. That looks like a pretty good plan to me. It's so much dill that it might just make your head explode. Dill and dill, this, this is nuts. We're, we're just lunatics. Mmm. Good? Mm-hmm. Watch me steal one. Uh -oh. Double dill. Pizza's done. I'm gonna steal one of my wife's. Try it. Dip, dip, dip. Mmm. These are so fresh. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Double dill, friends. Mmm. Friends, give us a thumbs up on the video if you like double dill. Maybe they... And tell us about your favorite chip. Maybe they don't get dill pickle. I don't know. Do you get dill pickle, the friends? Don't wait for them to answer because it's not live, you know what I mean? It might take a while. We're getting crazy, okay? Now, you need something to wash it down with? Pepsi Max, good choice. That's good stuff. And we didn't know, we were silly. We didn't know Pepsi Max was diet until like a couple months ago. We had seen it in the store, we're like, oh, I wish they made that in diet. And we checked and it was sugar free. It said zero sugar on it and we got excited. Like that. <laughs> Friends, no. we're getting wacky. We're gonna dip these heat wave Doritos in dill pickle dip. Oh my gosh. Friends, you can't do that. That's illegal. Pray for us. That's illegal. Pray for us, friends. Tell the friends about Snorditch. Okay, friends. Do you know about if something snorts you? Like Nicole tried this just off camera, the Dorito, in the dill. It was too much flavor and she started choking. It was really spicy. So when something snorts you, it means the flavor is overwhelming. It goes up in your nose and you just start coughing. You don't actually choke. You just, it just snorts you. That snorts you. You know like if you take a breath of pepper. <coughs> no, yeah. <laughs> if you breathe in pepper or like a really strong like dill pickle, you bite into it and it's like really sour. Yeah. Or yeah, it snorts you. Pepper is probably the best. Yeah, pepper is probably the best example of snortage, but dill pickles do it too. Yeah. A real, a real strong dill pickle, you bite into it and you're not expecting it and it snorts. I don't know, these chips snort yet. Maybe this they're is so good. You gotta, I don't know, I would eat the heat wave by itself. Yeah, but they're good with dip. See, these are my plate, friends. But the dill in the dill, friends, you gotta try this. Get double dilly with get it. Get double dilly. Mm. And, and don't get snorted, whatever you do. Maybe comment down below if you ever snorted. If you ever been snorted by a chip or by a dill pickle, you tell us. Um, oh, like, if you open up a bag of, like, salt and vinegar chips. Yeah, and you and start coughing. And you go coughing. right in and snort and smell it, that'll snort you. Yeah, so if you've been snorted, you just comment down below. Snorted. Just like that. Snorted. You could even do snorted friend. We toasted the pizza twice. Yep, so that's the binger again. We'll have to check it out. Maybe it's ready. Maybe. We'll take a look. Okay, friends, these are fresh out of the toaster oven, and oh my, I think we better start our own pizzeria. Oh, we're pizza masters. Look at that, friends. Masters of the pizza. Now, mine looks a bit better. Like, I just have to say <laughs> that, but a mine little more saucy. Beautiful. See, Nicole's not a saucy friend. I'm a saucy friend. I'm a semi-saucy friend, you see. Look at those pepperonis glistening, mm. in, the moon, glistening in the moonlight. They're beautiful. Yep. Okay, friends, these are going to burn our mouth, so we got to let them cool. And do, That's how you cool. <clears throat> and do whatever Nicole's doing. Like I'm going to go eat my chips and dip while these cool off. Me too. I'm going to eat them like that. Howdy, handsome. Hi. I put my pizza in the freezer because I'm hungry and I need to eat. And it's too hot. Hey, when you were little, did your grandma put ice cubes in your soup to cool it down? She did. <gasps> my Nona did too. Friends, let us know. Grandma ice cube soup. Or Nona or or Baba or whatever grandma you had. That looks lovely. I'm cut it up. I'm gonna try it up now. I'm, I'm gonna take a look here. Wow. Oh yeah, here we go, here we go. Oh, <gasps> stringy. Look at how cheesy that is. Oh my gosh, it never ends. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> You're the cheese monster. You're the stringer. We're making our own pizzeria. <laughs> mm. 
Is it good? Good choice on the garlic bread. Can you taste it? Yeah, it is amazing. Friends, make your own man pizzas. Mmm. Mmm. Mm hmm. Yep. Oh, yeah, we're going to go like do a, it. Like a good pepperoni pizza on top of garlic bread, if you can imagine that. Oh, my gosh, that blows your mind. <laughs> like that. <laughs> There's a handsome face again. <laughs> we have a nice ice cream, but not tonight though. Today though. Oh. Afternoon though. <laughs> it's an afternoon delight. I can't open it. Uh oh. What happened? Those muscles are supposed to open it up. They're fake. Hank's eating dinner, friends, so that's what that banging in the background is. <laughs> Excuse the bowl banging. <laughs> Hank's always licking, eating, banging something. Okay, ready friends? We're gonna unbox it. All right. We've had this before and it's one of our favorites from the Ben and the Jerry. It is so good. From Tom and Jerry. I love that it has everything in it. Remember Tom and Jerry? I do remember Tom and Jerry. Oh, that's a thing of beauty. Hey, we never told the friends what's in it. They know what's in this. It's caramel chocolate ice cream with chocolate cookies, swirls with gobs of chocolate cookie. Cook, cook. And peanut butter cookie dough. Go to go to. Gobs of chocolate chip cookie dough and peanut butter cookie dough. Pretty mm. much everything except the kitchen sink. And I don't need this lid anymore, so I mangled it because I ain't gonna need this because I'm crushing this whole tub. Well, that's sad. Okay, take a big scoop. Get out of here. Take a big scoop for the friends. Okay, friends. Whoa. It's right out of the freezer. It's a bit, a bit solid. Mmm. Oh, well, you can it. see a ball of dough. That looks good. One of the best Ben and Jerry flavors that we get in Canada. Now there is some in the States that we eyeball all the time, but we don't get them. So, but this is- But we get that one and it's good. Yeah. Mm. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm. Let's show the friends again inside. Oh yeah, look at that's just lovely. I love Ben and Jerry's, they don't, skimp on the mix-ins. You got huge balls of cookie dough in there. I like that crunchy chocolate cookie swirl that goes through it too. Yeah, that that's a such a good flavor. Now, I I don't think is it is theirs called the tonight dough in the states or is it something else? Yeah, tonight dough. It is the tonight dough. Right. Cuz some of the ones we get they're called yeah, they different, have different things. Names, yeah. That is a beautiful tub of ice cream there. If you have any cravings, they're probably in here. Caramel, chocolate, cookie dough. Oh yeah. I know it's amazing. It covers everything. Yep. One of the best friends. You guys mm, gotta try this. Things of beauty. Hey! Friends, the friends, in the comments, let us know what your favorite Ben and Jerry's flavor is. Yeah. We just got chocolate therapy here and that's pretty good. Mm -hmm. But I don't know, I think I'd have to say that this one is. But Million Flavors is really good, but I don't think that's what it's called in the States. I think it's called Everything But The... Yes, that's what it is. So yeah, your Everything But The is our Million Flavors and it's delicious. Yeah. But this is one of the best. It is. And it's time to finish it off.
You don't know? I don't know. What? What I'm gonna eat. Oh, for the last snack of the day? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of stumped too. Like you were saying before, I know I want carbs. I think I want a Pop-Tart and some crackers, I think. Whoa. That's what I think. That sounds yummy. But we should tell the friends about what we ate for dinner. Oh yes, friends. We had the boneless boxes from KFC. So you got chicken tenders, I think three piece chicken tender, an individual fry, individual popcorn chicken, and then a side and we chose gravy. And they were delicious. That's our yeah. first time having the chicken tenders. Ah, oh, they were really good. KFC came through. Mm-hmm. It was really like fresh and hot and delicious. And I'm so glad we had that. It's most of what I love the best, which is the skin. <laughs> I love their popcorn chicken. It's my favorite. Or the breading, I should say. There's no skin. The, on yeah, it. their breading is really, really yeah. good. That yeah, their popcorn chicken is my favorite. So we should ask the friends what's their favorite thing to get at KFC. Yeah, because it, it wasn't good for a long time, but we went today and it was awesome. So we might be going back. It was so good. So friends, let us know what you get at KFC. Yeah. Hey, do, does all, does the whole world of friends have a Taco Bell slash KFC? I don't know. I don't know. Our KFC is a slash Taco Bell. Yeah, so you can get both either mm. or, or both. Does that happen at your house? <laughs> <laughs> okay, friends, so I'm thinking Pop-Tarts and crackers. Um, so that is the end of this day, and we hope you enjoyed the fancy day. Yeah, thanks for hanging out with us. Mm -hmm. And don't forget to like and subscribe, because if you don't, <gasps> <laughs> you'll get the top doom. Thanks for watching. Bye, Bye guys. <laughs>